Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to show you a simple way how we can easily use Affiliate Marketing Go F Pro on Shopify. So the first thing what I will do, I will just click here Add Application and then I will install the app on Shopify. And here we go. So the first thing uh, what I will click on is get started. And now how familiar are you with FM marketing? Let's say I know what FM marketing is. Basic setup, we will walk through the basic setup of the app. This setup only scratches the surface. Okay. First thing first, let us decide on how much commission you want to give your uh, affiliate for a successful referral. The commission is awarded to your affiliates whenever they send your customer. So let's say a 10% commission. Now where your affiliate send you a customer and he buys, let's say 50 worth of products, the affiliate gets five euro in commission. This is really important to calculate how much uh, your product is going to bring you profit, not revenue, but profit. So let's say that I know that from 50 euro, my profit is, let's say 15. So we need to after taxes. This is really important after taxes. Uh, so what you do is that you just like have like 15 minus 5 because 10% uh, is going to be commission. So 50 euro is for price of the product. 10% is 5 euro. Your profit from it is 15. So it's going to like be around 10, right? Yeah, I know that in a moment when it's going to be 5 euro, you're going to pay less taxes because uh, you can pay, you can add your uh, referrals to the expenses, your affiliate to the expenses that you pay them. So there will be even less in the taxes, but you know what I mean. So we need to really calculate how much money you want to spend. I'm going to leave it on, you can have it as a percentage or flat rate. Many people got also click through acquisition. So they're going to give you uh, many affiliate programs got like five euro after you recommend someone. Uh, you know who got it like this? Uh, Fresh books, QuickBooks. I think they got by five dollars and also uh, some companies too. But percentage is really good. Click next. What about coupons? Do you want to give discount coupons uh, to your affiliates to share with the followers? I'm going to click skip for now because I don't want to do it, but you can do it if you want to. Next thing we do is let's store visitors know our affiliate program. Copy our affiliate portal link. So this is the copy. Open the shop's navigation menu. So open it. And we are going to just add the product here. Add menu and let's affiliates menu item at save menu. So you can do it right here, or what you can do is to click on main menu and edit right here also affiliate and paste the link click add see so now what i will do i will just come here to the online store and yep so home affiliate affiliate save And voila, here we got it. Earning up 10% for every successful referral. How does it work? Damn, nice. Okay, I have done this already. Now, customize the affiliate portal now that your affiliates have a place to register and see their sales earnings. It is important that the portal looks and feels a part of your store. So we need to add a logo. And when you're gonna add a logo, you will see the logo in the top left. I can add some baby Yoda here. And then you can change also the brand color and affiliate portal manager. Save and continue. Congratulations, basic setup is done. Let's recap what all happened. 
okay we create an affiliate we have a logo we have everything right pretty simple pretty easy test if everything is set up correctly it's a good thing to test if the app is set up correctly. this is ops for basic testing we will do three things you can create a new affiliate account or if you want to so just click here and just add a new account So we just tested it and voila, here we got it. So as you can see, we got it, create affiliate account. This is our account, name, email, referral link. And look at this, we have marketing tools here where we would have like what they can use, payments. Pretty simple, pretty easy, right? Take a note of a referral link. We'll be using this next step, next step. Click on the referral links. This should take you to your store. And voila, here we got it. You see the referral right here. And now you see that we got some referrals one. Pretty easy, pretty straightforward. We got it. Referral save now. I'm going to skip this step, but you can also test the referral save. And voila, here we got it. This is how you can use it, maybe later. Now, when you would enter GoF Pro, I want to show you how we, we can uh, edit. You get the FL portal, here, the links here. On the left side, you can go to look and feel and change the FL portal URL, store profile, store logo, brand font, brand primary color, literally everything. Then you have landing page that you can edit um, how the whole landing page looks like. You got sign up page and you see that what kind of sign up page you want for your uh, affiliate marketing. Then you're gonna see affiliate dashboard and this is the dashboard that you, what you want to have in your affiliate dashboard. Right here. And then you have toolbars. Like shopping with toolbar etc now when you're gonna see uh, sales you would see the sales of no sorry commission now default commission is 10 percent affiliate commission you can have like set commission for an affiliate product commission set a different commission for different products or affiliate so sometimes uh, what they have is that they offer different commission for different product you see it right here, four commission on black t-shirt, 8% commission on affiliate B on any product. Then you have coupons here. Uh, you can give coupons to affiliates for non-referral link based on promotions. Again, you can set it up if you want to. You would have affiliates here, sales, payouts that you need to pay. Creatives. This is the creatives that I recommend for you to use. Uh, let's say that you would have banners, right? Or some special links. So that's good. Marketplace. Uh, you can upload things. Post checkout pop up. So this pop up is shown to your customers after they complete their checkout and you can give customers that they are going to become your affiliate so they will promote your store more bulk mail you can send emails multi-level marketing you can have sub affiliates and they will all get commission when the referral say i don't really recommend doing this it's like i would i don't really like multi-level marketing in e-commerce but it's my preference if you want to you can set it up and then you would have analytics here also what you can do is to click here on settings and just like edit your settings for your store as exclude bot um, edit payment support and payment methods as a paypal you can add more payments method default payment method that's what i recommend for you to add as a paypal and that's pretty much it so thank you very much guys for watching if you're gonna have any questions ask me down in the comments and have a great day and goodbye see ya